guys, it is Laura and you are watching Laura X Annie. So if you haven't seen my part one of my uni haul, go over there. This is part two. So I forgot to mention two things in my part one. First is this cabinet, you're getting a close up to it now. It's like a trolley and um, it's where I'm going to hold all my stuff in it. That was £49 from Ikea. Totally worth it, I swear to God, it's going to be amazing for toiletries because basically I'm sharing a bathroom so it's going to be amazing just to kind of have all my stuff in my room and then obviously transfer it into the bathroom when I'm in. And the second thing is this ironing board which is a tabletop ironing board and it's from Ikea. Only £4, totally worth it. If you're like me and you love ironing clothes, go for it. It's worth it. Now on to the fun part, clothes and beauty. So first thing I'm going to start off with is this top. This top is from Forever 21. It is from the plus size section. I love it to pieces. So it's kind of got a V here, it's purple, it's got a wee alien. But the best part is, it says, I don't know if you can see it, it says spaced out in the back. Or spacing out, I can't remember what it was. But I love this top, it's so comfy. Also from Forever 21, I have this. This is a little ribbed bodysuit. So, and it's got the kind of class at the bottom, but I bought this specifically to wear with like jeans and tuck into this skirt, which is a, this is also from Forever 21. This is a green corduroy skirt. I love it so much, it's like a little mini skirt. I'm so in love with it. The 70s are back guys, the 70s are back. And from ASOS, I have this which is connected. It's this, <laughs> don't laugh, it's this beautiful, beautiful bra that um, has little eyelash, it's like eyelash lace, but it's got these kind of wee bits on them. I love it, so comfy. That was 28 pounds, by the way. And for a tenner, I got these, which are a set of three belts. This is from the plus size bit, by the way. And it's, there is rose gold, silver, and gold. I love them. I also have a top from Boohoo, which I'm gonna insert a photo of on the model here. It's actually out in the washing line just now because I've been using it so much. I love it to pieces, so that's it. And also, these are from Boohoo as well. They are these lovely little fluffy earrings, very reminiscent of Perry Edwards in the hair music video, Little Mix. I love it, so I love these so much. Then from Topshop, I purchased some socks. So the first ones are these ankle socks, which are pink with some white detailing. Then there's these green khaki green ones that are ankled, they're glittery. And then there's these, which are like fishnet ankle socks. Be interesting to see how these go. Moving on to bags, I have three bags to show you. The first one is from Primark, and this was three pounds. And it is a Slytherin tote bag. I mean, it's glittery, it's Slytherin. Can I not? Like, we all know I love Harry Potter. Another Harry Potter bag is this. Now, I can't remember how much this was, but this is a laundry bag. So I think this is gonna be really handy to take my laundry down in. And plus, it's got a little bit, I can put my phone and my, like, card in it. So I love this, love it. And, of course, for bags, this is my main bag for uni. It is from JD Sports and it's an Adidas bag, but it's huge. I love it. This was £28 and it's so beautiful. It's got a laptop bit in it. I cannot wait to use it. Now on to kind of beauty essentials and stuff. The first thing I have is, is this. It's the Colgate Max White Expert White Toothbrush and Whitening Pen. So my mum bought this and then didn't want it. So I was like, I need a toothbrush really. Can I have it? So it's meant to whiten your teeth and just a toothbrush and tooth. So I thought it was very interesting, very different. And to the exciting bit, I love this bit. So I got Zoe's new from, this is a addition to the classic collection. Um, this is her like makeup bag. It's full of goodies, let's dive in. So first up is a very funny thing that I have and um, it's this. It is the Swarovskoff Live Ultra Brights or Pastel uh, Colours and this is in the colour Sea Mermaid. Now, ironically, today I've just had the blue all chopped off my hair. 
I just had my hair cut and all the blue is away so I no longer have dip dye which means I'm going to dye it a bit blonde again but that's okay but still I have that in case I do dye it blonde again so we didn't realise I was going to get my hair cut when we when we bought this so this is something I swear by for nail polish this is the Bose Wrap Highest Magic Nail Polish Remover Instant Removal 1 Second Per Nail Without Cotton Wool I love this, this I swear by this so I had to get a new one that's some makeup -y bits, I got the Rimmel 24 hour colour precise eyeliner this is just a liquid eyeliner you know my trusty collection uh, clear mascara swear by this and I tried out this which is the same matte liquid lip colour by Rimmel and this is in the colour Rosetto liquid, no plum this show so got that just to try it but it'd be good. Also I have the collection Eyebrow Kit and Brunette. Now I usually have the blonde one of this but I bought the brunette one this time because I'm kind of enjoying having darker brows so and it's coming into the winter months so a wee bit darker. Went with that. Of course I can never go wrong without my simple makeup wipes. I bought two so I don't run out so soon into uni. And of course Elegant Touch uh, Totally Bare Short Stiletto. 006, this is what I've been using for ages now. These are brilliant, I love them for my nails. You get two wears out of them and they actually last a long time. It means you can paint them whatever colour you want. Swear by it. Now on to some Zoella stuff. Now if you guys don't know, I'm a tuneformous Zoella fan so I bought some of her new stuff. So first up I've got this which is the sour, the sh sour? This is the shower sauce which smells. insane it smells like roses is that how anyone else would describe it that's how I describe it it smells like roses I love it and I love the packaging in the bottle next up I have from the same jelly and gelato range this is the creamy scrub now this I really like I'm very interested to try it because I love her other scrub but this is like like a creamy consistency so it'll be interesting to see what it smells like. My mum was like, oh yeah, it smells too strong. I was like, we'll dilute it with water. Be fine. And then I had to get, I've not had this yet. This is the Zoella Hand and Heart Hand Cleanser. So it's a, the, what do you call it? This is what's been leaking. This is um, the lovely, what do you call it? Hand sanitizer. So love a bit of hand sanitizer. And finally, if you don't know already, I love her scrubs. I love the Tutti Fruity scrub so much, so I bought the Pretty Polished. I've had to buy another one. I'm not even finished the first one yet. That's how much I love this. I can't wait to use this at uni. This is my probably my favourite product Zoella has ever brought out. Zoe, keep making these, please, for the love of God. I love the little beads when you rub it into your skin. It's amazing, and my skin has never felt so clean and so soft since I started using her scrubs and I noticed a difference when I stopped using the Tutti Frutti because I ran out of it, I noticed a humongous big difference so it is noticeable. So that's it kiddos, that's me for my uni haul, I hope you guys enjoyed this video and I'll see you guys soon with another video. See you then, bye!